the Vampire Academy books, and here is all six. So let's get started. I have the movie cover, so these books might look a little different than the other two. The first three, I should say, are all soft cover, and these are older covers, if you couldn't tell. Then I have the last three are hard covers, and I just have all the older books. So, and the new ones, this is what the new ones look like. I'm not sure what, which ones I like better. I kind of like mine because they're hardcover, and I'm pretty sure these are all soft cover. And then also by Rochelle Mead here is Bloodlines. And I'm probably going to get that soon. I haven't gotten them yet, but I really want to read them. So, first off to know about this whole series is there's three ty two types of vampires. And then another kind of group of people are the Dampers. And Dampers are born sort of stronger, and they're fighters and warriors, and they go to school to fight and protect the Maroi. And when they are 18, they have to, they have to get assigned to protect a Maroi. So a Maroi is a vampire, but, oh yeah, Dampers aren't vampires, if you weren't sure. Um, they're vampires, but they have to drink blood, but they also can eat food, so they don't have to live off it. But they take blood from humans who they decide to do it, and they volunteer for it. And they, just from the endorphins, when they get their blood, you know, sucked out, they get a high and they get addicted to it. So they, a lot of humans volunteer to do it. So the Maroi, they have to drink blood kind of daily to get more energy, but they can still have to eat. And they're good vampires, they're kind and nice, and they can, they have elements, and some of them are fire, air, and water. And there's another one that's unknown called Spirit, and that may be what Lissa has. And I'll show you the characters, explain a little bit more in depth of them. So after. then the other group I was talking about is the Shigoi, and they are bad vampires, they're evil, and they have no souls, and they live off of blood, they go and when they take blood they kill the humans or they usually go after the Maroi and that's why the dampers need to guard them and they kill you when they do or they can change you into Shigoi and they're really bad and they don't eat anything except for take blood and they're really evil and they attack a lot but then the dampers they don't go and hunt the Shigoi but they wait for them to come when they attack and then they attack back. I was really confused with all those three types of people and I was really confused but then when you fin go through the series you like it more and it makes more sense okay so also I think for just an overview of all the books it's really good except I can predict it so easily like they're like wait what I'm confused what do you think they're doing and I'm like I already know I can predict already because it's kind of obvious but then they take them a while to understand what's really happening and I already know what they're going to plan to do. And it's kind of a really obvious and predicting situation sometimes. But then some, especially in the last book called Last Sacrifice, I I was totally shocked at the end of this. And there's going to be no spoilers at all. I'm not going to add them at the end or anything. So I'm not going to say what it is. But I was so shocked because I predicted someone else who did what the thing is. So I'm not going to say, of course. And so these books are really good. You need, you should totally get them. I love them. It took them a, me a little long to read, but I love them. And you should read them too. And see the movie. And the movie's good, but the books are always better. So I hope you enjoy this video. Please comment, like, and subscribe. Thanks for watching. Bye.